Oi, lad. How's it going, then? I am well. And you? Oh, I can't complain. There was something I've been meaning to tell you. I met your dad. It was a long time ago, in London. I was just a boy. Well, didn't meet him, really. Just saw him do a fella in the London Opera House. I was sitting in the balcony with an uncle of mine. Went to have a piss. And when I came back, there's your dad. Dashing as they call me was. Shirt, jacket, immaculate. My uncle was just slumped there. Looked like he was sleeping, but I knew better, even if I was only a child. Your da locked eyes on me. <laughs> and I don't think I've ever been so frightened as I was in that instant. It wasn't a fear that he was going to cause me pain. It was this sense that he saw right through me, into my heart, and he would crush it if it had pleased him. But he didn't. He just raised his finger to his lips and gestured for my silence. I complied. And then he was gone. That must have been in the days before his betrayal was made public. He would have sailed for the colonies not long after. I'm astonished that you were actually there. You can imagine my surprise when I saw his face. It took me a while to piece it together, but uh, there you have it. Thought you'd like to know. Thank you. <laughs>